Welcome to Top 5, I'm Jackie Powell, and this is where we take a look at the five key stories that everyone is talking about. This time, with the year-end look back season upon us, we're recapping some of the biggest moments and trends in and around music culture in 2022. So, let's get started. The most anticipated album this year came from, who else, the queen bee herself. Beyonce dropped her club-ready album Renaissance this summer, and it quickly climbed the charts, with the record's lead single, Break My Soul, becoming her first solo number one release since 2008. Thanks to the massive popularity of the latest season of Netflix's Stranger Things, the singer's most recognizable record made a comeback this summer. Running up that hill went mega viral, meaning you could hear it everywhere, on TikTok, on the radio, even in the grocery store, all while introducing the British art pop singer to a new generation of fans. For as many highs as music fans had this year, there were also some lows. But while the music world is still mourning the loss of Foo Fighters drummer Taylor Hawkins, it also came together to celebrate his life and his love of music, with friends and family throwing an epic charity concert in his name at Wembley Stadium, featuring performances from his Foo Fighter bandmates Liam Gallagher, Queen, Paul McCartney, and so many more. To be sure, the concert was one of the most emotional events of the year for music fans, with this outpouring of love and awesome sight of Hawkins' son Shane absolutely crushing the heavy assignment of sitting behind the drums with the Foo Fighters to play My Hero. R.I.P. Taylor, you will never be forgotten. Megan Thee Stallion had an unmatched year in 2022, continuing her legendary climb while proving there's nothing the original hot girl can do. She released her successful sophomore album, Traumazine, cementing herself as one of rap's most gifted lyricists and quotable song stylists. She entered into a production deal with Netflix, partnered with Cheerios for a popular Super Bowl commercial, became the first ever female rapper to perform at the Oscars. Oh, and she just joined the MCU. The Super Bowl halftime show is consistently one of the most watched TV events, and in 2022, hip hop dominated one of the world's biggest stages. Dr. Dre, Mary J. Blige, Eminem, Kendrick Lamar, and Snoop Dogg came together to pay tribute to the genre, blending old favorites and new chart toppers for a performance that will go down in the history books. No, really. The show was such a spectacle that later in the year, it won not one, but three Emmy Awards, including one for Outstanding Variety Special Live. That's all for us today on Uproxx Top 5. I'm Jackie Powell, and we'll see you next time.